But first, they've cycled all the way from John O'Groats to Land's End, then took a cab here. It's the Sport <laughs> Relief cyclist Russell Howard and Miranda Hart. <laughs> You are heroes. Oh, bless you. Are, are you sad or sore? <laughs> 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 yes, please so take much. that. You, your ass must be oh, killing. Lovely. <laughs> oh, that's oh, nice. Is that nice. <laughs> Actually, I have to say, what the downstairs department was hideous. I was in tatters. Oh, it was in tatters. Yes. <laughs> really? What yeah. was it like? Wafer thin ham sort of hanging down. <laughs> <laughs> we had we had a big pot of lube on the bus that we, uh, we had to apply. Obviously, we had our own pot. We didn't have a big pot that we all grabbed. <laughs> <laughs> but we were, given, we were given special stuff that's designed to ease cows through birthing. So that gives you an indication as to the battering that our arse is receiving. But I watched the uh, I watched the video diary and I was really I was expecting like day one, you know, we're up, you look so miserable, yeah. you're depressed. <laughs> I mean, Fern Cotton, who I think is one of the prettiest women around, she looks like Miss Marple. She's like, we just left Birmingham. <laughs> I haven't slept. I mean, it's like, I you all look what, like shit. Imagine what I look like if Fern Cotton looks like that. Yeah. What? Oh, what? Well, what? I know, I wonder who's this Piltdown man. <laughs> <laughs> so who else went with you? I know David well. Dave went, uh, Davina went, she was lovely. Uh, Paddy Kilty went. Yeah. And Jimmy came for about three hours, didn't yeah. he? Jimmy Carr, that is, isn't he? That's yeah. right, yeah. yeah. Jimmy rocked up like America in World War II. Just came along, saved the day. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, nothing prepares you for the sight of seeing Jimmy not in a suit. It was kind of weird. You see him wearing that, he wears a little hat. It's very odd. He looked like he'd had a proper breakdown. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I saw the thing and he was sort of like... You don't expect him, but he was, like, t grabbing his crutch, going, God, I'm very sore around here. And I'm like, oh, no, Jimmy, I don't like this. But, yeah, <laughs> but it was that because on the first day that he started cycling, he was going up and down on the pavement and stuff, and he had a little hat on, and we were all a bit worried about him. I thought, what's happened? Yeah. It was very weird seeing Jimmy Carr just go, la, 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 la. <laughs> Dressed as a gimp with a hat on. He looks like a gimp without all that. This is it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've got a, a little clip of you all right. on your ride. Everything hurts. It was tough. That was very tough. You know in Star Wars, when the Emperor is going, don't give in to your hate, that's where I feel like. <laughs> and when you reached Land's End, how did you get back home? They didn't expect you to cycle back home, surely. No. Well. Oh. That was the, the ending was the best bit. We finished, um, and uh, it, was, it was quite exciting, because Davina's family met her, and Dawn French met Miranda, and David Williams got a supermodel girlfriend, and all that. I've also got no one. Yeah, we literally, uh, me and Patrick Hilty <laughs> turned to each other, and I said probably the nerdiest thing ever. I went, apparently they've got sandwiches inside. So, so we were... We were eating our sandwiches, and then um, Peter Jones, he's the guy from Dragon's Den, oh, yeah. rocked up. Very tall, very handsome man, wasn't mm. it? That was, yes. uh, David Williams was all over him. It was phenomenal. <laughs> yeah. and, um, and, and he was there, and I'll be honest, I was a bit like, what's he doing here? He's done nothing. Yeah. This yeah. bloke's stealing all the glory, like whispering to everyone. And then he said, uh, uh, after about sort of 10 minutes, he went, yeah, do you uh, fancy getting a lift home in my private jet? And I was like, what a bloody lovely bloke. What a good... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. And you should have seen it. It was the most unbelievable thing you've ever... We were in a private jet. I was giggling the entire way. <laughs> never got taking photos. <laughs> <laughs> they brought us out sandwiches, no crust. How tacky and yet posh is that at the oh, same time? Yeah. <laughs> and I said, I said to Fern Con, I was like, do you reckon this will ever happen again? And she looked me up and down and went, no. <laughs> <laughs> it was great, man. It, was, it was, it was brilliant. Really fun. Now, congratulations, Miranda. You won Best Comedy Actress at Best the RTS Awards. Best Comedy Performance at the RTS Performance. <laughs> I love your sitcom. Oh, do you? Yeah, I do. Thank you. Well, you have to say that now, but no, I believe I you. I believe you. <laughs> and it's quite autobiographical, but you keep getting mistaken for a man. 
anything. Now, is, is that in real life? Well, in, yeah, in the first episode of the first series, I did get called Sir by a delivery guy who came. <laughs> <laughs> And um, that is, that does happen to me. Yeah. Really? It doesn't happen to uh, you. See, the pity R is always. You no, know, it, it really does. Well, you well, notice no they... one went, no! They <laughs> yeah. went, ah! Oh. <laughs> 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 they were like, no one corrected. <laughs> no, they're just not really looking and it's, they just notice the height. I think it's the height, short hair. And then that, when I they get... look at me, they go, sorry, madam. Yeah. I'll... I just <laughs> slap them across the cheek with a tit. Yeah. <laughs> Um, Russell, you've had an amazing year. It's been all right, too. Well, the sell-out arena tour. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I mean, that's pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, right. Your show, Russell Howard's Good News, was the most-watched show on BBC Three ever. Right, now, it's amazing. <laughs> that's the way to do it, thank you. And you were voted number eight in Heat's Weird Crush. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, oh, yeah, but Weird Crushes is, um, essentially makes me number eight in the list of King of the Munters. Um, <laughs> Why do you have a weird crush and not a normal well, crush? Well, probably because I have monkey teeth and uh, a lazy eye, so, uh, you know, probably got something to do with that. I, I have noticed it a few times. Yeah, I'm, I'm slightly boss-eyed and that tends to be a bad look mm. because people think I'm drunk or inbred. <laughs> I mean, with the lazy eye, because you know when someone's got a lazy eye, you never know which one's the one yeah. that's not. So you end up doing these Tai Chi moves, like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is that, and, and the problem is, having a lazy eye, you find yourself Can you trying to that? compensate. Can <laughs> you say that? Can you? Are you oh. giving me the finger? <laughs> you ain't got one at all. No, but look, like you're just gonna lie at me. No, no, I was trying to see if oh. he could see it. <laughs> Can you... Look at me. Look at me and see. Can you see that? Yeah. What? I don't understand what you're doing. <laughs> you know your lazy eye. Because yeah. if I don't want, I can see that one, what I can see that way. It doesn't mean that oh, you it's see like that. that way. Yeah. 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 I thought it was, honestly. He can't, he can't yeah. look at you and yeah. see the audience. I'm not like a, I'm not like a toad. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's your, um... It, 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 it's your birthday next week. It is, yeah. Big free oh. yeah, nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh dear. Looking forward to being in your thirties. No, I'm depressed about it. No, How old are you? Brilliant. Thirties is brilliant. Is it? Yeah. But no, I'm not happy about it. I'd rather be young forever and cheat death. <laughs> I'm not being funny, but you know, I'm not. Is being... it back to the eye again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as, as you get older, give me a patch. Somebody get me a patch. <laughs> as, your eye gets, as you get older, yeah. does your eye get lazier? <laughs> I don't even be bothered to open. Yeah. <laughs> oh, son, it. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I'll be in an old folks home. I'll have to have a mate. Just lift it. Just attach it to rope. <laughs> Paul Mildred. <laughs> uh, I hope not. I really hope not. Or no. I'm going to look a mess. Okay, thank you so much. Miranda Hart and Russell Howard, everyone. <laughs> It's good, I enjoyed that. Yeah, After the break, David Hay, Justin Bieber and Florence and the Machine will be here. I'll see you in part two. <laughs>